Hello, Mr. Skelly. What the heck? Somebody stuck his hand in his butt. I told you to stay away. Oh, my God. <laughs> what are those? Holy crap, guys. Today we are in St. Clairsville, Ohio at Ohio Valley Mall. And right ahead of us is the Spirit Halloween. This actually used to be a Sears. All right, let's go in here. I'm curious to see what's set up. And unfortunately, when we first step in, there is no Mr. Dark. Even though there is a sign for him, there is no Mr. Dark. He disappeared into the dark. Okay, oh, and there also is no experiment number four. So obviously this store is also waiting for all their animatronics. We do have a couple set up here though. All right, this time we get to start with the Night Stalker. Okay, Mr. Laughable. <laughs> okay, that's enough. <laughs> All right, let's move on. We got a jumping spider over here. See if he jumps. We got, yep, there he is. Hello, Mr. Spidey. All right, we got the Harvester of Souls. Oh, and it looks like we got the fog going. There it goes. I don't see the light in his mouth, but it, oh, there it is. Yep. Pretty cool. It took a little bit for the lights to come on, but still pretty cool. All right, let's check out Mr. Wacky Mole here. Okay. Bad Halloween costumes make me crazy. <laughs> they make me wanna follow things with my hammer again. I think, I think I'm going crazy again. <laughs> Look how crazy and messed up his hair is. Surprise, boys and girls! <laughs> One more. Next to get walloped by my hammer. <laughs> I'll be the first on your block to say, Wacky Mole, clump me over the head. <laughs> okay. Thank you very much, Mr. Wacky. Yep, we're still waiting for Ophelia and Evelyn Leach over here. Wait, what in the world? is this i have not seen this in any other stores holy crap this is awesome michael myers knife sign it's an official lamson john covered his halloween the night he came home this is totally sweet and look down here we have the talking animated tiffany doll let's see if she works nope she's not working right now Okay, but I don't think I've seen her in any other stores either. I don't think I've seen the Maleficent fleece blanket in other stores either. Maybe, maybe I just wasn't looking for it, but they have a couple of them here, and here they have a Krampus. They got a couple of good time dolls here. Oh look, they have the uh, Stay Puffed, that's pretty cool. We have this little guy here. I love this one, they got two of those, but no burrito, baby. Something for the bucket. Oh look, we got a sitting scarecrow set up over here. Let's see if he works. Yep. <laughs> look at that guy, you gotta love sitting scarecrow. $99 on sale. We got a whole bunch of jumping spiders. There's always a ton of jumping spiders available. Let's see if they got them all. We got the black, we got the brown, and we got the black and red. Yep, they got them all. I see the Carvomatic up here. We're gonna go check that out in a second, but here's some more jumping spiders. I'm just trying to keep an eye out for uh, other animatronics on the floor that are for sale. Great selection of Halloween masks. Halloween, Halloween 2, Halloween 2018. Oh, we got a buzzsaw on the floor here for sale. And I noticed the guy over here setting up buzzsaw. We're not gonna go on that side because I don't want to interrupt him, but I do see the Nightcrawler here. He already jumped and tried to scare me. You didn't get me this time, buddy, but maybe next time. We got the Carvomatic going, and we got this guy over here trying to get out of his skeleton hole. <laughs> we got Mr. Howell here. This is actually the entrance from outside, but I came in through the mall. Here's Mr. Howell. Let's get him going here. All right, we want to hear you. There we go. 
And I hear the Hauntress over here. She just jumped out, but we'll come back to her. Okay, look, she keeps jumping out. The sensor must be set. Yeah, because she doesn't have a, a foot stomper. <laughs> okay, jump at me again. Come on now. Come on, there you go. All right, there we go. Look at this, we got a couple of these over here set up. This is cool. All right, apparently those are on clearance. I don't know why, but okay. I know, I hear you, we already talked to you. Maybe next time, let's go through the chains of death. Chains of death. Okay, I hear impaled Andy over here. <laughs> Oh, I'm sorry, I almost missed you, Mr. Jumpy. And there is Buzzsaw getting set up over there, so we're not gonna bother them over there. You know, one thing I have not seen a lot or really anything of in these spirit stores ever, I think, is Children of the Corn. Children of the Corn is one of my favorite scary movies of all time. I really don't know what they would have, except for like, you know, t-shirts and socks and stuff like that. Hello, Mr. Skelly, what the heck? Somebody stuck his hand in his butt. I wouldn't want to be that guy. <laughs> hey, what is this? I don't think I've ever seen this guy before. What the heck? That guy is pretty cool looking. Apparently he's not animatronic or anything, but how cool is that? All right, we got the talking pumpkin door knocker and the talking sure reaper. Oh, here we go. You better be certain, dead certain. <laughs> <laughs> I haven't seen him in a lot of stores. I think I saw him in one this season so far, and he wasn't working. He's pretty cool. Let's see if we can get this guy going. Yep. Okay, what is this mug? That looks like a joker. Oh, it's, what the? It's a Krampus mug, but it doesn't have Krampus on it. That is very strange. Look at this, this is almost strange to see in here because they don't have all that many like traditional Halloween type things in here. Oh, this is cool. Look, they have the marshmallow trick or treat buckets. And if I'm not mistaken, yeah, look at this. Look at, it changes colors. That is pretty cool. Is it gonna work? Eh, sort of works. Okay, let's try this one. Nope. Nope, but it changes colors and I think it like strobes. That's pretty cool. Speaking of Children of the Corn, here's like a kind of a sickle. I guess that would work. You gotta love the Zero mug with the pumpkin nose. I love it. This is a pretty cool throw with all the characters from Nightmare Before Christmas on it. Okay, these would also work if you were looking to dress like maybe Malachi from Children of the Corn. I mean, it's not perfect, but it's pretty cool. This is one of the creepiest masks ever right here, the Nighty Night Mask. And that's the kind where you put your chin in there and his mouth moves with your mouth. That is cool. Wild Eyes Clown, Happy Clown, look at the nose. Look, we got Wrinkled Man, that's hilarious. Oh, somebody told me to be on the lookout for Jay the Killer, so here he is. Purple Neon Clown. That's a pretty cool looking one. Look at the hair. This is pretty cool. Look, this is the Overlook Hotel from The Shining. It's like blueprints of the hotel. Okay, this looks even better as a Malachi type knife, a Children of the Corn knife. Yeah, that is, that's awesome right there. I saw this in a store the other day and somebody got mad at me because I didn't know who it was. It's a character from Nightmare Before Christmas. I'm gonna have to watch that movie again. I actually have it on Blu-ray and DVD, I think. I think I even have like the sing-along version too. Oh, look what we have here, guys. This is the one I was talking about the other day. It's the ghost that just flies through the room because he's on this string here. Those are only like 10 bucks or something. And I believe they're motion activated. Look, it turns around so the face is facing the way that it's going. <laughs> That's funny. Oh look, they have the talking clown door knocker too. Oh, and he's working. You can't hear him very well because we got this guy over here going on. Excuse me, you two, could you be quiet? I'm trying to talk to the talking clown door knocker. And here's that scary flying ghost. Let's see, how much is he? Uh, 19.99. Yeah, that's pretty cool. All right, let's try to hear him again. You 
I always thought this was a pretty cool thing here too. The fresh grave mound simulates a freshly dug grave. It's just like a netting. Basically you make like a heap of leaves or something and then lay it down like that and put a headstone at the top and it looks like you have a freshly dug grave. Oh look, this guy's working. Look, his eyes are flashing and look at his legs going. That is hilarious. I gotta get this string off here so it looks better. Hold on, let's try it again. Yeah, there you go, look at that. It's hilarious, his legs kicking around. Oh good, this one works too. It's time for some fun now! <laughs> <laughs> let's see what else he says. I think he says something like it's party time. I don't know what he said right there. I think this is my favorite tombstone that they have right now. What is it called? The Crying Soul Tombstone. It's like a crying angel. Here's their clearance section over here. Look at this. They have this cool one over here, Astronaut. Look, your feet, your legs go down in the flames. And these legs just kind of hang. And it looks like you're flying, like floating around as you walk. That's cool. Gotta love the Incredibles. What the heck? A Will wig from Stranger Things. Oh, this is a cool one. A Super Skins Crash Test Dummy. I wonder if it comes with the steering wheel. No, but you could get a steering wheel. Rainbow Poop. All right, guys, we're gonna call it a day in this one. They still have a lot of stuff they're still waiting on to be delivered, so possibly I'll be back at some point this season and we'll see a lot more. But stay tuned, because we're filming a lot of spirits anyway. We're bound to see it all. Holy crap, guys. Today we are in St. Clairsville, Ohio at Ohio Valley Mall, and right ahead of us is the Spirit Halloween. This actually used to be a Sears. 